Hello everybody, Mobius1 here, bringing you episode 3 of Halo Infinite. Uh, we've just emerged from, what is it, Camp Outpost Tremonius, and we are now free to explore the open world of Zeta Halo for the first time, and... I'm pretty sure that's all we're going to be doing this episode, is is exploring. I would like to liberate at least one FOB, so let's take a look at the map. We're up here for now. Um, I do want to explore... Oh, good, we can zoom in and out. I want to explore all this because there's no anything critical out here, and it's not really that large of an area. So I feel like that shouldn't take too long. Um, if we can get over there, I'm looking at the map, actually. I don't know if we can... Re get across that chasm yet we might have to unlock a few things maybe to get there but uh actually what i let's what i want to focus on first is fob alpha uh when controlled forward operating bases reveal banish and unsc activity in the surrounding region serve as fast travel hubs and rally points for unsc marines fire support provide access to vehicle drops weapons and weapon variants gaining valor unlocks available resources at all captured fobs defeat the banished and access the control terminal to claim the fob so, we need to go south. I can't wait. Alright, let's, uh... We don't have a whole lot of options as far as gear goes right now. We have the Hydra. I don't even really know if I want to use the Hydra. I think... Let's go with the Assault Rifle and the Commando. I could really use another ammo crate. We just drained that one. Uh, so let's see... Oh, hello. Armor locker. Mjolnir locker. Mjolnir lockers contain cosmetic items that can be equipped in Halo Infinite multiplayer. Capture FOBs to reveal any lockers in the surrounding area on the attack map. Cool. Obelisk stone something? Oh, okay, so that's what that icon is. That's an armor locker. That's neat. Okay. Skewer. Alright. Uh, we're like, right. We're going south, which is this way. So I don't know if enemies respawn in this. Wait, what is beeping? Is this an audio log? Yes, it is. Banished audio log. Interesting. I don't see anything over there. Uh, there might not be anything worth going. I mean, there's got to be something over there somewhere, but that's not the direction we're going first. And interesting enough, coming down here uh, revealed a sniper rifle. So we're going to go ahead and ditch the assault rifle and instead take the sniper. Reward or uh, exploration paying off already. Like, there's just so much to explore. And we are just getting started, folks. Um, yeah, if you don't, uh, if you're not a fan of the exploration, this episode might not be for you. I don't know how many episodes of exploring we're going to do before we decide to progress with the story, but uh, I do want to 
I do want to liberate some outposts, so let's go ahead and do that. Oh, yeah, by the way, this game also has a day-night cycle. Uh, each day and night lasts about 30 real-world minutes. So... That's a thing. We're going south. This is south. Uh, what is that? Oh, there's a Spartan core. Let's go grab that for sure. We're gonna want that. Is there anything over here? I don't see anything. I forgot I can scan. So how are we supposed to get over here? Oh, wait. Is this a cave? No. Just some crates? What was that? I hear wildlife. Um, I do know that there are caves, too. Dude, the environmental ambience in this game is ridiculous, too. Alright, so a lot of this, a lot of me running around and just looking over cliffs and stuff, I'll probably end up cutting out of the video. Just because I don't think anybody really wants to watch all this. Right. Here's a Spartan Core. We're not going to use this one yet. Right? Because we, we want to get this quick shot, which requires two. So, as soon as we find our next Spartan Core, we'll be able to get that. Okay, this looks like this might be the only path out of here. Ooh. Oh, there's two there? Are they stacked? <laughs> oh, shit! Jesus Christ! Was not expecting that. I don't think this is the way out. I think we found, like, a, a loot cave. Okay. Did he go back inside? Jesus, that scared the bejesus out of me. Yeah, he's in there somewhere. So what's in here? A heat wave? Is that it? Looks like that's it. Interesting. What do we want to do with this sword? Uh, honestly, I'd rather have the sniper rifle. But my commando is kind of low on ammo. Eh. Sniper rifle sword isn't a great combo. I think we'll be all right. So the question now is how do I get out of here? I guess I have to go east first. Oops, I don't mean to do that. I mean, it looks like there is a path here, but we have to get on the other side of the shipwreck. Do we just climb with grapple hook? Are we. I mean, I guess we could just go over it. I just thought maybe there would be, like, a path that the 
game wanted us to take. But maybe not. Unless it's down this way. Oh, maybe through here? Does this have a switch to open it? I feel like this, this should open somehow. The music, though. I'm not cutting any of this because the music... It's too good to, to skip or not listen to. Do we maybe have to get in the pelican? Oh, I wonder if that's it. I wonder if we have to get in the pelican before we can progress. I bet you that is it. But, oh yeah, look, out of bounds. Hello there. Activate. Where did that just activate? No, seriously, what did that just activate? I have no idea what I just did. This thing? All right, it looks like maybe we do have to actually just get in the pelican then. I think we might be stuck in this little area for now. Unless we can go that way. Let's let's try and go around to this path to the left and see if we can even get over there. Oh look, there's another Spartan core. And just like that. We've got quick shot. Ooh. Oh, no, 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 wait. There we go. Beautiful. Full. Oh. Oh. Yeah. All right. Sorry. We got to take that. We're going to go rocket launcher, battle rifle combo, baby. Anything tasty in here? Don't look like it. No, see, there's no way for us to get over there right now either. All right, we have to do the pelican then. Okay, here we go. Okay. That's beautiful, 
isn't it? To some. I have a question. I was created to lock down Cortana, but I don't know why. What did she do that was so wrong? She was our target. I understand that, but... Is this classified? Because I don't have all the information. Chief, this is insane. I see vanished everywhere. Did you hear me? Everywhere. What intel did Dr. Halsey give you before your mission? Halsey only tells people what they need to know. Fly a pelican straight into enemy territory. No one will ever notice. Great idea, big guy. <laughs> I still don't understand why you had to delete her. It feels like something's missing. Guess what? They noticed. They all noticed. And we've got a baddest structure up ahead. Armored. Very heavily armored. It'll have to wait, I suppose. How close can you get us? How close? We're unarmed, and you're asking me how close? Uh, There's yeah. Here. Here? Oh, yeah. We're still doing this. Hope this works, because it's as good as it's gonna get. It's close enough. Dude. Okay, and just like that, now we're in the open world of Zeta the Halo. Signals origin. Source. Unclear. There's just too much chatter on all banished channels. I keep hearing the tower. It's probably the main structure we saw as we flew in. Okay, so I see a bunch of dudes down there. Let's check our map and see where exactly we got dropped off. Okay, so we're actually right in front of FOB Golf, which is probably what that beacon of light I saw was. So here's recovery. Okay. Oh, here's the tower. Oh, there's a lot of stuff in there. One weapons lock or one armor locker, one human data log, two Spartan cores, a skull. And a UNSC, or no, a UNSC data log. I guess the other one's a banished data log. Maybe. What's an FOB golf? Just one UNSC uh, audio log. All right, man. And, and maybe we can go that far south. Look at all this, all this stuff that we flew over. Can we go back to here? No. Okay. Well, let's get FOB Golf because it's right here. Um, whoops. I fell. All right. I was going to see if maybe we could get creative. Look down there. We're close to the fob we detected. You take out those monsters, get me to that terminal, and I'll show what I can do. Oh, uh, here's the fob right here. Alright, we're gonna... I know stealth isn't really an option in this game. Oh, look at that. They spotted us already. With the battle rifle, though... All right, here we go. Ah, no. Oh. That looks like it. Work that, huh? Yep. Now to business. Let's lock down Fob Golf. Let's get this first. Fair enough. Is the escort fleet in position? 
Aye, sir. We've got six Mulsan frigates in the advance group ready to move. Acknowledged. Have them set course at full speed. Hopefully we won't be far behind. I don't like this waiting. We're sitting ducks out here. There's another one. I like that they beep so that you know that they're nearby. lost we are not interesting spartan sorrel let me see yes i was right all i need to do is chat with the banished security protocol and by chat i mean push it out of the way because it is really not smart and there we now have ourselves a second fob okay is that you affirmative so what you're going to just Rebuild the UNSC? Piece by piece? That's his call. I'm just trying to be helpful. Speaking of which, each fob seems to be linked to the battle net. And if I do this, we can piece together what the banished are up to. For instance, over here is some kind of banished outpost. Purpose? Unclear, but it's well defended, so it's definitely worth looking into and blowing up. And here is what I can only describe as someone that the banished value highly. Noted. His bio is interesting. If you want to see for yourself, it's waiting for you in the database. They're I like that. They're tracking UNSC transponders too. Caches containing valuable equipment and intel. Oh no. It looks like there are multiple UNSC squads engaged in trying to survive. They need your help, Chief. You know, I'm pretty sure a lot of people are going to look at this and just cry, oh, it's Halo Far Cry. I don't care. This is awesome for me. I have I think this type of game suits Halo, like, perfectly. So, all right, we've this episode's been going on for quite a bit. I don't know how much of the exploring at the beginning I'm going to cut out. But let's pick one of these objectives and go for it. I'm thinking the bounty. Target status active. For the last de decade of the war... Acro Vagadoon was considered one of the most lethal infantry assets in the Covenant and was granted the title Blade Master by the Minister of Resolution for his combat acumen and ability. The target is known to carry a modified energy sword. All right. Can we set that as a, we can set that as a waypoint and then What do you think? Oh. I already told you that the odds aren't great for them. Then let's go find out what that signal is. Okay, so you can summon weapons and stuff, but we don't have enough valor to call in anything besides a pistol right now. Can we see... FOB... Okay, yeah. So right now all we have is access to the mongoose and the pistol. At 400 Valor, that's what this little 400 is, I'm guessing. You can, we could call in uh, Assault Rifles. Yeah, I'm just making sure you can see my cursor on the video. 450, we could call in Marine Reinforcements. Razorback at 500, Frag Grenades at 550. Okay, so it's like every 50... Well, I guess there's a jump here. Heavy Assault. This is what we need. We need the Battle Rifle, so we need 1100... Valor, which right now we have 350. For the sniper, we need 1500. What do we need for a wasp? Ooh, a scorpion at 2000. Oh, look, the special weapons. There we go, wasp, 2600. And the rocket hog, 3200. All right, well, we're going to be getting all of this eventually. 
And let me just see, does it say how much valor we get for these objectives? Uh, this one it does. This one we get 100. This one it doesn't. This one we get 30. So do we not get any valor for this? Wait a minute. Targets. Here's the dude. Oh, he's got a whole bio you can read. Still don't see anything about Valor on here, though. Alright, let's go for it anyway. We got ourselves a rocket launcher and a battle rifle. What could possibly go wrong? Um, I could... There... Ooh, shh, holy cow. Dude, look at that. That's Ransom Keep. And we've seen plenty of video footage of people attacking that. Just look at how many enemies are down there. Oh my god, and they have patrols outside of it. That, that I think, is what we're going to tackle in the next episode. I don't want to go down there and mess with that in this one, because it's going to take a while. That, I think, is a whole episode's worth of content right there. So what we're going to do is we're going to stick to the high ground, and we're going to make our way towards this bounty target. That is amazing, though. Holy crap. It just, like, I've seen it. I've seen people attacking Ransom Keep in, like, multiple videos, but it just... It, it didn't feel this big. Like, that's, that's huge. And that's really exciting to me for, like, what else is to come. Hello here. There's a ghost. Do I want to mess with them? We have to go that way. Let's just drop. Alright, I'm not I'm not messing with you yet, at ransom keep. Skirmisher. Yeah, I don't care. I don't let that grunt live. So he can just consider himself the luckiest grunt ever. Dude, I just... This is so reminding me of, like, the second mission of Halo CE. So cool. What ship is that? That's a big ship. Is that the banished, like, mothership or something? Because it almost looks like the Infinity. Alright, we got here a lot quicker than I thought we would. So, let's take a look. Uh, yes, this this actually does look familiar. I think I think IGN attacked this in one of their preview videos. So, we have to uh plan our Oh, hello. Yeah, those rings have like stuff coming out of them. Sorry, getting distracted. Human attack! Hey there. <laughs> okay. So what is this? Scan artifact? What? Forerunner artifact? You've scanned a forerunner artifact. These mysterious constructs can be found across Zeta Halo and are encoded with ancient data. Decoded artifacts can be played back in the database. The 
This thing is old, very old, and full of data. Well, if you can call it data. Most of it is encrypted in ways I don't understand, but I was able to figure out one small part. There are more out there. I can feel them communicating. That's cool. So that's something the game didn't tell us about. I wonder what else is in the game that it's not going to tell us about until we discover it. Does that show up on the map? Yeah, Artifact... Artifact 3. Interesting. Well, I don't see markers for Artifacts 1 or 2 anywhere. So... Oh wait, what is that? Oh, that's that, okay. Alright. Let's go get this bounty target. What the hell was that? Ooh, that's a guardian from Halo 5. That's interesting. Okay. I don't know how close we can get before this place aggro's on us. I see crates over there. We've got our rocket launcher, though. There's the boss. The dune is nearby, Chief. Be careful. He's got quite a rap sheet. Thousands of UNSC personnel died at his hands. Time to make it right. All right, how do we want to do this? You know what I would love is if he walked in front of this. If I fire a rocket down there, the damage from the rocket plus the explosions of all that would probably do quite a bit of damage. But it looks like he's just going to walk back and forth over there. Alright, do we have any snipers to worry about? I like how tense the music just got, too. Alright, there's another elite over there. I think that is a- yeah, that's a jackal sniper right there. So we're going to take him out first. I don't see any others. Yes, I do. Alright. Any other snipers I should know about? There must be a cave right below me. Reinforcements? Wait a minute. Nope. Nope. Alright, where's this guy? I see you. Did that do it? Oh. Did the reinforcement? The reinforcements killed him! Oh, these reinforcements are gonna kill me though. Come on, big boy. I found him. I found you. Target and crew eliminated. Life on this ring just got a little safer for the UNSC. 
Hey, did you get a look at that modified weapon the target was carrying? Hell yeah. Pretty inventive, even for the banished. So I copied it. I've sent updated schematics back to our forward operating bases. Should give us an edge. I'd nice. suggest sending a thank you card for the upgrade. But you killed the intended recipient, so we can skip that part. I mean, technically, I didn't kill him. I shot a rocket at him, and then the reinforcements landed on top of him, so... I guess that's one way to do it. Is there anything else around here I should pick up while I'm here? An audio log, something? Dude, this is amazing. It's absolutely amazing. I could just literally just run around all day and have fun with this. So let me see. Did that increase our valor at all, though? No, it didn't. So we still have 350. Uh, and then this target killed an action. Nice. So we don't have... Everything else is undiscovered. Okay, so what's what's closest to us, then? This Spartan Corps and Carrera Squad. Let's head over there. We'll free Carrera Squad and then probably end this episode. This is just beautiful. Beautiful freaking game, man. Some nasty brutes in there. Oh, Kerr squad's that way. That brute's got a lightning rifle, or lightning cannon. Is that what that is? Yeah, I think that's what that is. Okay, we're gonna go this way, though. What is that noise? Oh, hello. Yo, this is just like ODST, and I love it. Oh, there's my Spartan Core. Look at this. Look at this. This is so cool. Rockets? Oh, I dropped my rocket launcher. Oof. Oh. Okay. This first. Ah, nah, sn again, sniper sword, not a great combo. But I want to try the sword out, so we're going to keep it. We just picked up a UNSC distress signal. The signature suggests a squad of Marines. Alive. No response on comms, but if they are, it's a sure bet they need our help. Let's find them. Um, I wonder if I should free them now or later. Oh, you guys gotta go. Here you go. Okay. That's pretty awesome. You're fine, you're fine. I'm sorry. Do look at them swapping guns. That's why the Marines call you a legend, Chief. Dude, short and sweet. So good. How much value do we get for that? 30? Find a better gun, soldier. Yeah, plus 30 valor. Earn valor to unlock weapons, vehicles, and Marines. 
Marine deployments and controlled FOBs. <sighs> Look, there's guns. What do you think those beacons are for? Are you guys? Let's move. You guys are following me now, huh? That's pretty cool. Where's the fourth one, or did we lose one? I also love how you can tell the sun's setting. I don't know if we can even get over there. Look, there's a bridge, but it's not extended. Are we able to extend that? Or is that... Pr probably extends through story progression, if I had to guess. Let's check it out, though. Let's also see how good these marines are at following me. Yeah, I don't see any bridge controls. I don't think this is something that we can extend right now. This probably comes through progression. Alright, where are my marines? Oh, they are following me. Okay. Hey. Let's go, Chief. I'm itching for a fight. Alright, so let's see how this quick travel works. Let's quick travel back to our fob. Fast travel online. How do I use it? R. Yes. Do my marines come with me? No. It just leaves them out there. Okay. But they're not still on the map. Okay, no, it's it's removed. And that completed. Not completed. Alright, so we have one core we could use for upgrades. I'm not really interested in use in delivering a powerful shockwave. Maybe that'll come in handy later. But let's go ahead and boost our shields by another 15%. What's in our database? This is where our audio logs are. And then, so area collectibles at the bottom left. So there's five weapons lockers, three of that other thing, seven more Spartan cores, two skulls, ten UNSC audio logs. Oh, so that other thing has to be a banished audio log. Three banished audio logs, twelve UNSC audio logs, unless all the audio, log audio logs share the same icon. There's one more... Forerunner Artifact, and five something. I think those are Propaganda Towers. Okay, so this is a different region then, because you can see when I highlight this region here, all that information on the left goes away. So I can, I can kind of see how this is broken up then. So we have... Oh, this might not even be a playable area. So this is all one region. This is the first region here. Then it looks like maybe all of this is a region. This looks like its own little region. Then this. Ooh, what is that? That's an interesting looking structure. Okay. And then that's neat too. Huge water area. And a massive mountain. All right, this is gonna be, this is gonna be fun. All right, that's gonna be it for now. Let's wrap this up. We'll try to keep our videos around thirty to forty minutes each. I obviously can't guarantee that based on what we're doing, um, but I will tell you what we are gonna do in the next episode is we're gonna go after Ransom Keep because this place is begging to be attacked. Look at all this. Yeah, baby. Alright. So, leave a comment and a like down below. Let me know what you guys are thinking of this series so far. If you're playing it by your... Or if you're playing it on your own. Or if you're just watching me play it. I'd love to hear uh, how much you guys are enjoying it. So, thank you very much. Mobius1 here. And I'll see you in the next one.